What's up everybody, this is Master EN Gamer, and the 2021 Overwatch Lunar New Year event is finally here. And in this video, I'm going to be taking a look at all the brand new cosmetic items, including the new skins, which we can see here on the splash screen. But let's just go ahead and jump right on in and take a look at what's new. Alright, so starting with the epic skins... Terracotta Medic. Wow. That, that, that's like taking the Stone Brigitte skin and making it even more statue -y. That's a straight up Terracotta Baptiste. That's awesome. I love this skin. <laughs> it's such a cool design to go with. And of course, this is one of the weekly challenge skins, which you need to play nine or get nine wins every week to unlock each of these three epic skins next is jaiki i'm not even gonna pretend to know how to pronounce that um hmm i'm not exactly sure what they're going for here they have some sort of like rice hat though those definitely are feathers on his cloak I want to say this is a Korean skin. It might be a Chinese one, though. Yeah, I'm not sure whether this is Korean or Chinese, and I'm not sure what it's going for, but uh, it's a nice-looking skin. It is just an epic, though. Oh, also, let's take a close-up of this. I like that. <laughs> this terracotta skin is awesome. Anyway, Imperial Guard, Reaper. Huh. Ooh, I really like the dragon detailing on his cloak there. These are some solid epic skins. I think they're very nice. Alright, legendary time. First up, Tiger Huntress Ash. This is a skin which we did have teased, and oh my, I quite like this skin. Tiger Bob is so cool. <laughs> I also really like Ash's outfit. It's very different from what her other skins have. It's all around. I think this is a really good skin. Close up of the gun. Oh, what is this? Some little like parcel? Some purse parcel type thing? Not exactly sure what that's supposed to be. And of course, big old Tiger Bob. All right, but let's move on to some other ones. Dragon Fire. Whoa! This is an awesome skin. So there's a few different uh, Bastion skin ideas which have been floated around. And this one, I'm guessing is supposed to be like a dragon sort of kite or either like a kite or the dragon dance things where they have like the long you know like dragon that a bunch of people hold up on sticks like what all the heroes have the sprays for i forget what the actual term for that is called it's like dragon dance or something i'm guessing that's what this is supposed to be because yeah even ganymede <laughs> ganymede is a chinese paper lantern that's awesome Oh, oh, the mouth opens up like that. This is such a cool skin. Tank mode. <laughs> Dragon face on the back. Looks so goofy. Oh, man. It's not quite the fireworks cart skin I'd been uh, hoping for, but this, this is an awesome skin for Bastion. This is so good. All right, moving on, though. We can't just stare at Bastion all day. Kachi Echo. So this is a Magpie Echo skin. You know, I think it's grown on me. When I first saw it in the teaser, I wasn't sure how I felt about it. But I think it actually looks pretty nice. I do think the face still looks a bit weird. But overall... Oh, the feet are really interesting too. Those are straight up, like... <laughs> raptor claws right there. Overall, I think this is a nice skin. I do quite like it. Moving on, Bull Demon. 
Wow, now this is an impressive skin. This was teased actually earlier today on the Overwatch social media. This is a rather intense skin, <laughs> I'll say that. Very similar to her demon skin from, I think, two Halloween events ago. Although I think I actually like this one better. <laughs> it's, it's an interesting design. Kind of like the Echo skin, I wasn't sure how I felt about it at first. But now that I'm looking at it in more detail in-game, I do rather like this skin. This is pretty cool. And the last one, one we have not seen teased yet, Pale Serpent. Widowmaker, of course. Huh. I'm willing to bet this is uh, like a character from some Chinese or Korean like mythology or folklore. I don't recognize what character it is, though. Hmm. Skin looks nice, though. I'll give it that. Oh, I love that snake on the gun. <laughs> that looks really cool. Yeah, I'm not sure what character this is supposed to be, though. But a good Widow skin, I'll give it that. Victory Poses. Sparkling Company. <laughs> yes! I have been... Oh, I've been so badly wanting Brigitte to get a Victory Pose with her cat. And we finally have one. <laughs> Good old Mitzi. The Lion Roars. <laughs> oh, that's a funny one. It's also weird seeing Moira with like the healing just staying like that on her. It almost looks like a different skin though. <laughs> but I like that. And... Hung Bao. So I guess that's like the New Year money that they give people or a fortune. I don't remember which one it is. Maybe both. All right. Voice lines. Stubborn as an ox. Life's a rodeo on the good days. Assistance is all you need and a little good luck. Gong Hei Fat Choi. Oh, I wish I could eat. Oh, poor Echo. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right, May just moves. <laughs> Unsavory. Strong as an ox? Ah, strong as eight oxen, maybe. Look at Yar from the horse. You work too hard. How can anyone tolerate such chaos? For red fireworks, use a strontium compound. Green Tribarium. Hmm. All right, and sprays garlic, terracotta squad, <laughs> thunder, among the lanterns, dragon flight. Gratitude, Gunsmoke, Bull's Fury, Siwong, Eye to Eye, Year of the Ox, and the competitive ones, three new highlight intros. I don't think we've ever gotten three highlight intros in one event before. All right. I like that one. That just sort of feels like a better version of her selfie highlight intro, in my opinion. Because it's the same thing. She basically just flies in, ejects, and then does something when the mech explodes. <laughs> Very similar. Maybe a little too similar to the selfie one, but I think I like this one better. Fan dance. That's nice. I like that one. And I believe this is Echo's first uh, new highlight intro as well. And Shining Bull.
Ooh, that's a cool one. Alas, Symmetra still has yet to get a skin. It's been more than two years without an event, event legendary skin, I should say, for Symmetra. But at least she gets this cool highlight intro. All right, and that does it for these cosmetics. However, we can still take a quick look at the... What am I looking for? Player icons. Uh, let's see. Got to collapse it down to Lunar New Year. So we got Year of the Ox. It's the new one you get by default. And then we got Magpie, Bull, Stone-Faced, Bandit, Imperial, Tiger, Serpent, Dragonhead, and Wanderer. All right, so those are the new player icons as well. And real quick, 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 before we exit out, there is a new free-for-all deathmatch bounty hunter game mode. Um, so it's like you I get points by killing people. I'm not exactly sure how this works, but uh, I'm going to be trying this out after I make this video because I'm very interested to see what this new deathmatch variant is going to be. That's going to be interesting, so I'm going to be trying that out. But otherwise, that does it for this quick video. I think right off the bat, I gotta say Dragonfire is probably my favorite of these skins. I also really like Terracotta Medic, though, even though it's just an epic. I just love what they've done with the whole thing, the whole theme they put on it. So yeah, this is probably my favorite skin from the event. But let me know your favorite cosmetics by dropping a comment down below. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe, follow me on Twitter, hit up that bell icon, and come join me on Discord to hang out and never miss any of my future Overwatch content. Special thanks to my YouTube channel members who help make these videos possible. And if you'd like to join them to earn some cool rewards, like your name at the end of my videos, then just hit that join button down below. Otherwise, this is Master Ian Gamer signing off, and until next time, have a great day.